what's up video bloggers I'm not gonna steal too much out of this vlogs intro because this is just the intro to the vlogs you're gonna be getting this is not an actual vlog right here I'm gonna be taking a break from vlogging and I won't be back until sometime in mid to late July so today you guys are gonna be getting a triple shot and there's gonna be one vlog that comes out every four hours okay it's also the very first unvlog that I've done here being back home in the islands so it's gonna be the unvlog 9 and I hope you all enjoy and I'll see you back in July oh my gosh I'm so very stressed that's right what is this vlog number five no swearing I mean I know I said freaking a couple of different times but I'm trying to still abstain from unnecessary swearing. It is necessary because of the stress. <laughs> you see how the F came out? But you know, I'm working on trying to eliminate the cursing, okay? E even as much as I've been trying to express things that are very important to me, Things that I'm passionate about, I'm, I'm, I'm still having to fight it. So what's up, video bloggers? Here comes this nephew. You ready for it? No, you're not. You're not. No, you're not. Sit down, get some snacks, get a drink of water. Ready? What's up, video bloggers? I hope you're all doing good out there. Hope you're all feeling osta, cho. Um. So this is going to be a short vlog because I have to update and I have to mention some things that I have been failing to mention. The Suzanne has been asking about Taza. Where's your lizard? Taza. Um, and, um, you, know, you know, she's asking like how is he doing and you know, all this stuff and you know, was he able to come here? You know what? I think I've been so freaking bummed that Taza is not with me that I just chose to like push it down and suppress it because like now I have nothing living physical that was with me in New England and I really I, I miss New England so much I miss everything about it I miss everything I, I got all this gorgeous natural beauty around me but I don't feel happy Going to Pounders is probably like the only thing that makes me happy. But you know what? I, there's, there's, there's a void. There is a void within me. And it's like I'm just always trying to gasp for the next breath because I don't feel satisfied. I don't feel satisfied. Okay? So, what happened was, the day before I left, I was going to mail him the day before I left. So that way, when I get to Hawaii, he'd be fresh in the mail. You know what I'm saying? Um, and you know, you gotta remember that this was like October. Yeah, I mean, you know, mid October was actually still warm. But the thing is, is that I know that, like, that pets are sent through the mail. Okay. And then I came to find out after getting turned on by the USPS and then getting turned on by UPS that um, FedEx is the only one that does it. And when I called FedEx, they said that they don't do it. So it's like, it's this, it's this game. It's this game being played. And so you know what, I just, I was just so stressed. And I didn't want to stress out Taza, you know what I mean? Because he's this little guy. You know what I mean? Yeah, albeit he's a two foot beautiful bearded dragon. But I don't want to get him stressed out and um, the woman said, she said, you know, you might want to think about this because when they put a lot of these packages that go overnight, they're put in the belly of the plane. She said, there's no seats, there's no like, you know, because when you look at a plane, like the top half is where all the passengers are at and the bottom half is where all the cargo is. And at that height, even though I had two heat packs inside there, she said that she's afraid that he would like freeze. And I know it was getting cold at that time of year, so I'm just like, ah. And then you know, there's a there's a ban on lizards here, 
So I, my brain was like going through all these like options, you know what I'm saying? I was just like, okay, that option fell through. What's next? I even thought about fucking taping him to my back until I got to Hawaii. But number one, that would have been really uncomfortable with him, even though he'd be on my body heat, which he really loves being on my body heat. Um, and number two, due to the generous advice of my love, Keith, he said, you know what, if you get busted with that, you're going to get fined for, I can't think of the word, but it's like you're stowing away something. They could impound him and you could never ever see him again. You could also get hit with a monetary fine for trying to do that. So it's like, you know what? I'm glad that I had Keith's sound advice to go by, okay? I really do. Um, and so Sherry, out of the kindness of her heart, because you know, I was gonna I was gonna give him away, you know? I was gonna give him away because I didn't think I was gonna be able to make it, right? Which it's true, but Sherry said that she would take care of him and she's been doing a pretty good job. So Taz is not here. I miss my Tazzy boy! Man, I miss Tazzy boy so much, man. Like, I look back on the old vlogs and he sat next to me and I'm like... I'm, I'm video blogging, yo. You, you totally throw my flow off, yo. Come on. Come on, come on outside. It's nice. It's, not, it's, it's, it's nice. It's nice out here. Come on out. Okay. Mm, this guy is so freaking special. I love this guy. Mm, I love you. You know that I love you. Hey, Taz. Hi, Tazzy boy. Hi, my boy. Taz, Taz. Taz, get over here. Good boy. Come here. Come here, son. Come here. Sonny boy. Come here, my sonny boy. Mm. I love this guy so much. Tazzy boy. Gusha, come here. Come here. Come up over here. Come here. Tazzy boys. Oh, easy, Taza. Easy. Oh my gosh. I got Taza right here in my lap and he's flipping out just because Tazzy boy is coming up over here. What's the matter? You, you know who your brother is. Yeah, you know you guys are brothers, right? Yeah, exactly. So, um. Thanks, son. I needed that, buddy. Sonny boy, what's the matter? Hey. Hey, you're a troublemaker, huh? Come here. Go share. Get Lee. Come here. I'm not gonna spank you. Come here. I never hit you, son boy. Come here. You are my heart. You are my soul. You be my Tazzy boy when I grow old. You are my sonny boy. You're my best friend. You're in my soul. Hey, 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 hello. Okay, enough of that. I love him so much. Fortunately, they're both with their loving mom who's taking care of him. That's a little solace I can find in my heart, you know? So you know what? Uh, you know, I've been so freaking stressed out. And you know what, since I hit my head, on that fateful day, November 25th, 2016, I have not been the same. My stress level is like down. It's, it, I mean, I mean, for most people that sounds like a good thing. But what I'm saying is like my stress defense rather, my stress defense is very low. Like when it peaks, like when it breaks through that ceiling, 
of my stress defense. I'm done for the day, man. I, sh I shut down, I close up shop. I'm done, I cannot. Because it overwhelms my brain too much and then I start getting the migraines. Okay, I mean, I get migraines irregardless of the stress. Okay, but the thing is, is that it does not help the migraines. You know what I mean? There's, the stress doesn't, you know, I've been sick. Wow, oh, God, oh my God, I'm, I'm nauseous. That was not just timed or anything like that. I, I just got really nauseous because I was thinking about, like, <laughs> for the past week, for the past six days, I've been sick. I've had, like, okay, check this out. I went to see my doctor last Saturday, and I weighed 210, okay? Which is, you know, I, you know, that's, uh, what do you call it? That's, um, uh, plateauing, right? But then I got this virus, this stomach virus again, just like the same, like when I had it on the 1st of May, uh, this time it came back for vengeance. But what happened was I have been having severe fluid loss for five, six days. And when I went to the doctors yesterday, I went to my new neurologist who I really like. Um, I found out that I lost 12 pounds. 12 pounds. I lost 12 pounds, that's right. So uh, thank you so much, Viral Infection, for helping me to get to my goal. But oh my God, like, uh, I, I can't tell you like how frustrating it has been to shake this thing. So yeah, you know. It's just been kind of uh, stressful. Today is the only day this week that I get to go to Pounders. But, you see, I have to go to this appointment, right? Which I was like, okay, I'll go to this appointment, which is in the next 10 minutes. Uh, and um, then I can go to Pounders. But I had to make this call today. And they told me that in my paperwork, I failed to sign the last page. So, uh... After this, I gotta drive all the way. Right now, I'm in Haleiwa. My doctor's over here in Haleiwa. I gotta drive all the way to freaking Kaneohe. But on the way back, I'll be hitting Pounders up. But today's the only day, the entire week, that I'm going to Pounders. I got depressed, so severely depressed last week that it was it was a it was a crippling bout of depression. So much so that I could not fight it, and I was just like, I give up. I know I wanted to go to Pounders, but I can't. Anyways, I am here, and I will see you all next time I see you all.